Assalamu alaikum. Hi everyone, how are you? How is everybody doing? Today again, another dish, another plate, easy, not that much to make. First of all, we're gonna start with crushed garlic and some mustard powder. I have here some seven eggs, cracked already in my bowl. I have some breadcrumbs with salt, oregano, and black pepper and paprika. Here I have some chicken strips or chicken tenders, whatever you want. Okay, so we're gonna start. We're gonna mix our eggs all together with the mustard powder, and we're gonna add the garlic. My loved one, I love garlic. So here we are, we're gonna mix them very well. Okay, so just the mustard powder and garlic. No salt, nothing add to the egg. Just mix them very well. You know what this means very well? Very well, until you fill everything, it incorporates all together. So bite the egg yolk and the seasoning, okay? So you need them just like yellow juice. The egg, it will be best on this recipe today. It's gonna be really easy and not that much time, not that much money, not that much effort, and so forth. So the, the crumb spread, you can add the paprika, salt, black pepper, and oregano, like I said. Mix them very well, very well, very well. Okay, because that's the seasoning. It goes through to the chicken. That's why we didn't put any salt in the egg mix, okay? So, mix them very well. Any kind of crumb bread you want, mostly if you buy the plain one, if you could, or if you could make your own at home. This one is my own, my homemade crumb bread. So, yeah, I have the sheet pan already greased. I'm gonna dig or dip the chicken tenders or chicken strips all in the egg mix make sure you soak them very well on the egg make sure one hand it's dirty with the egg the other hand it will stay clean because you're gonna take them out from the crumbs bread or the bread the bread crumb sorry 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 so here you go uh, one hand it will dip the chicken and the egg, the other hand, it will just fold it in the crumbs, the bread crumbs, put it back to the sheet pan because it's gonna go back to the oven. Okay, and uh, this process it's really easy, it doesn't take time. The kids will love it. Your friends, uh, any snack time outside, if you go for picnic, it's really good, it's healthy if you don't need or you cannot eat any fried chicken, there it is. It was in the oven at 350 for 20 minutes, 25. I served some with mashed potato and cheese. It's homemade mashed potato. I will share with you how I did uh, my mashed potato. Uh, so uh, the other hand, I use this chicken tenders for my friend. She has some uh, thing going with the kids and the family and friends. So I make some for her. Actually, I cook for her. She is the best friend ever. So uh, one, uh, one of the, my best friends here in America. So awesome lady. So here, it's really crispy from outside. Very tender and soft and juicy from inside. Yummy, yummy, yummy try it you you gonna let me know okay either you let me know in arabic or you let me know in english it does not matter it just matters how we present the things and it's matter how we accept each other the language it's not a big deal okay so i did uh, steam the corn and i saw the garlic and asparagus Thank you for watching, thank you for your time, share, like and subscribe.